Tough. Now, we know that Northwest Arkansas is a great place to live, of course, and so does our first guest, Jill, so much so that she wrote this book right here that I'm holding, 100 yes. Things to Do in Fayetteville, Arkansas Before You Die. Now, listen, it's not a morbid tale. It's just really about all the things that you can do here in Northwest Arkansas, which is great. Jill, thank you for joining us. Yeah, thanks us. for joining us. I'm happy to be here. Thanks yeah. for having me. Well, where'd you get your inspiration to write this book? Well, it is kind of a dramatic title, Before You Die, <laughs> but it's really just a fun experience. I was contacted by Reedy Press, the publishing company. Um, they were looking for someone to write the Fayetteville edition of this national book series. Right. Okay. And I thought, well, that has to be me. I'm a writer. I've lived here for more than 30 years, grew up in the area. And so I decided I wanted to take that project on. I yeah, that. I'm glad that you did, yes. too. And obviously, you've given us a hundred things to think about there. What are maybe what, what tops the list for you? What are your some some of your favorites? That's probably the number one question of I course. get. Of um, course. And it's hard to say just you know sure. one or two, but yeah. I think some of the fun ones that maybe people don't know because yes. obviously there oh, are yes. the yes we want to we know those yes. yes yeah well. Um, you know, Flying Q Farms. I don't know if you've ever ridden horses out there. Okay. It's five minutes from downtown Fayetteville, wow. out by Lake Sequoia. Oh, I do know it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's just across the street from that city park. Okay. And you can saddle up on horses there and go on a guided ride for a couple of hours, which if you don't ride, is enough to get a little saddle sore. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> but fun, but worth it. And um, you know, I'm so glad you said that because I've been to that city park before and seen oh. the horses over there, but I didn't know that that was open to the public. Yes, yeah, so you get the, you know, you take the guided trail ride from Flying Q Farms and they go across the street into the park and they ride all those trails yeah. through there right by the lake. It's beautiful. Yeah. It's a lot of fun and it's a very different experience. Yes, absolutely. I'm going to keep your bookmark where it was, but like right here where we are, see the sunrise at the top of Mount Kessler or rock climb the boulder at Boulders and Brew. Right, that's right across another the street. one that's yeah. really fun. It is. It's yeah. just down the street. Nice. Um, it's beautiful. If you ever walk in there, you will just be overwhelmed by the walls full of you know, all the holds to climb. A really fun experience just sure. right in the middle of town if you can't get outdoors to do yeah. something or you just want to maybe learn to climb. Or... Yeah. Jill, I have to ask, how many, because there's 100 things in there, how many of these have you completed? Ooh, almost all of them. Okay. I would say, well, I, I haven't jumped out of a plane. <laughs> Not yet. So, not, right, yet. not yet. So I haven't done that one. Otherwise, I've been to, I think, every single thing okay. in there. Yeah. Right. The research was fun. I bet it was. <laughs> <laughs> my husband and my kids all got dragged along. Uh, of oh, course. Nice. Yes, yeah. yes. I'm sure they loved every minute but of it. But that's what people should do because you can get out and about and see the town in a new way, whether right. you've lived here a long time or you're brand new. Yeah, sure. and take your family along for the ride. Yes. yes. Yeah. Now, this one is uh, Fayetteville specific. Yes. But any thoughts about expanding to Rogers, Springdale, Bensonville, Bensonville other, other cities, cities here yeah. in NWA? I happen to know there's a book in the works for Rogers, Bentonville. Okay. But I'm not writing it because I was writing this one right. when they were <laughs> right. trying to do that one. Right. While you were on your Fayetteville <laughs> adventures, they were on their adventures. Yeah. But I was talking to my publisher yesterday and I have two more things in the works for these books. So. Okay, that's great. Hey, yeah, yeah. this series that. expanding and always giving people an opportunity to get out and have some fun. Yes, in Fayetteville and Arkansas, it's going to be fantastic. Yes. Oh, I love this. Okay, listen here at the Folk School. The Folk School. I mean, there is so many things yeah. in here. Watch the sunset from Mount Sequoia. Uh, explore Devil's Den State Park, which I know a lot of people love to get do. Get yourself an interview on Good Day in WA. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah. It should be 101 <laughs> things to do. Right. I'm yeah. going to add that to yeah, my list. Yeah, you need to add that yes, there. Yes, 101 <laughs> things to do in Fayetteville, Arkansas. Uh, float the nation's first national river. Of course. And this book is also kind of sectioned into different things. So uh, recreational things, culture. Shopping and fashion, yeah. food and drink. And it really is all Fayetteville, except for those few things you mentioned, like the Buffalo River, right. just sure. an just hour a away, right. Devil's Den. But those, to me, are iconic places that if you live yeah. in Fayetteville, you that should be part of your experience. Sure. I mean, that, those are iconic day trips that you take. So yeah. those are in there, too. Thanks, yeah. Jill. So, thanks so much thanks for, for stopping filling by us today. in. Thanks yeah. for having me. It was of a lot to think about, especially now with the fall weather oh, and yeah. everything. Several things in there that we can still do that are even great right now. To do. And there's really more than 100 things mentioned in that book. Oh, there's sure. probably yes. close yes. to 150. Because you went above and beyond, of course. <laughs> <laughs> a few <laughs> tips, yes. you know, sidebars. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much, Jill. All right, well,